Elon Musk's Tesla Model Y just drove itself from the factory to the customer's house completely on its own in what's the world's first fully autonomous delivery of a car. And mind you, there wasn't one human involved in the entire process as Musk claims. Neither in the car nor anyone controlling it remotely, all thanks to Tesla's full self-driving FSD system. So Tesla doesn't use any fancy sensors like LiDAR. Instead, it uses multiple high-quality cameras placed all around the car that capture live footage of everything happening outside and feed it into something called Hardware 4.0 or HW4 in short. These are basically Tesla's custom-built computers that run the entire FSD system. Then, these computers pass the camera footage to Tesla's neural networks trained on billions of miles of real-world driving data collected from Tesla's across the world. Now, what these networks do is basically analyze short sequences of frames to do things like detect objects, identify road lanes, and even spot cyclists and pedestrians. And it's not just one neural network doing all this work, there's literally dozens of dedicated neural neural networks running in parallel all in real time, the computer then takes the outputs from these networks and builds a detailed 3D map of the environment around the car called the occupancy network. It shows what areas are blocked, which lanes are safe to drive through, and what's likely to change in the next few moments. Like if a car is about to switch lanes. Finally, the computer takes this live 3D map and runs its motion planning system to figure out exactly how the car should move and passes those decisions to the low-level control system, which converts them into physical actions like steering angles, throttle inputs, and brake pressure. And the most impressive part, none of this happens in the cloud. It's all happening inside literally every Tesla equipped with FSD. Now with Model Y self-delivery, maybe in the near future when your car needs service, all you need to do is book an appointment while it drives itself to the service center, gets fixed, and returns home entirely on its own.